At the beginning of each financial year, the employer needs to summarize the total wage paid to the employee and submit to ATO. This was usually done by lodging the PAYG payment summary. However, because of the single touch payroll, since this year, you will not need to lodge the PAYG payment summary anymore. If you are still asked by your employee to give them a PAYG payment summary, you can pass them this video. They no longer need the PAYG payment summary to prepare their tax return. As soon as you finalize the single touch payroll, all the information will be available on ATO, and when they lodge their return, it will be all prepared in their tax return. Either they are doing it themselves or do with the tax agent. The due date for finalizing the single touch payroll is on the 14th of July each year if you have 20 or more employees. If you have less than 20 employees, the due date is the 30th of July each year. Here I want to show you how to do it on Vero. First of all, you need to make sure the payroll has been done correctly. You can go to account and go to report. Once you get report, you can go to payroll and click payroll employee summary and then you can choose the last financial year. It will give you a summary of all the employee, the total figure of the wage, tax, and the super. This is the same information on the PAYG payment summary. Just double check the employee and their earnings to make sure they are correct. If you think any of them are not correct, you can go to payroll to the employee and check the employee individually. Let's assume it's all correct. Then you can go to payroll and then select employees. Once you go to employees, you can click the end of financial report. Before we use payment summaries, this year, the payment summary only goes up to 2019. You won't see the 20, 2020 option anymore because the payment summary is no longer available. You have to go to single touch payroll finalization. Once you go to the single touch payroll finalization, you will see all the employees and just pay attention to the year. It's 2019 and 20. Click all the employee, click finalize and submit to ATO. Once you've done that, the status will become pending. And after a couple of minutes, it will show lodged. And that means the single touch payroll finalization has been done. The confirmation will be sent to ATO. And when the employee lodges their tax return, all those information will be prepared in their tax return. So you can tell the employee there will be no more PAYG payment summaries. All they need to do is to do their tax return themselves on MyGov or to find a tax agent to do it. Either channel, they can access this wage information automatically. If you come up with an arrow status, which means there's something wrong with your authorization, you need to double check with your tax agent or contact ATO for correction. So that's all you need to do to lodge the wage summary in the future. Thanks for watching the video. If you think it's useful, please subscribe us and we'll see you again.